<coughs> Shalom, all praise, honor, glory to Yahweh, Bashem Yahshua, Bashem Kachadash, the ones to the elders, Apostle Great Milton, I thank you all for being all true sincerity. Um, this is Psalms 148, verse 14, it says, He also exalted the horn of his people, the praise of all his saints, um, even the children of Israel, a people near unto him, praise ye. Yeah, how about you, young shy? Um, the reason why I was going to this one, this is uh, going to be a short scripture of Jay, was um, basically the saints of the Most High are the children of Israel, the so called Negroes, Latinos, and the Americans. Um, and uh, they're the Israelites, because um, it says, you know, the praise of all his saints, even the children of Israel, are people near unto him. You know, and those are the, you know, children of God, you know, the children of Yahweh, the Heavenly Father Yahweh, you know, the representation of him on the earth, you know, because, you know, the Heavenly Father, if he came down here, um, he would, you know, look like, you know, a so-called Negro. You know, just like his son, Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai is from the tribe of Judah, and he's a dark skinned, you know, a dark skinned Judite, which the Judites are the so called Negroes. Um, you know, so, and Yahweh Shai looks exactly like his, like the Heavenly Father, Yahweh. He looks exactly like Yahweh, you know. So, they basically could be twins, you know, if you really, um, if you really think about it that way. But anyway, you know, we, we Israelites are a representation of, of the Lord on the earth. So, you know, we're his saints. And, um, you know. You know, we're considered above all people. Like it says, um, I'm just going to get you around me. And, uh, this is, uh, let me just do around these seven and six. Um, this is, um, Deuteronomy 7 and 6, it says, For thou art an holy people unto Yahweh thy power. Yahweh thy power has chosen thee to be a special people unto himself above all people that are upon the face of the earth. So, Israel, uh, the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Americans are a special people unto, unto Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. You know, we're above all you heathen nations. And, um, were considered holy, which um, I believe the Hebrew word for holy is um, I believe kadash. Kadash means holy. Yeah, because yeah, that's the Hebrew word for holy. It's kadash, um, which means a uh, holy means to be separate. So we're separate. Our nation is separated from you heathens, because we're above you. It says, verse 7, um, And Yahweh did not set thy, it's like Yahweh did not set his love upon you, nor choose you, because ye were more in number than any people, for ye were the fewest of all people. Because we, you know, we went into Egypt, we weren't a huge company, we, you know, and also, when, you know, you know, he, ch he didn't choose us because we were a big number, you know. He chose us because we were the fewest, you know. It says, but because Yahweh loved you, and because he would keep the oath which he has sworn unto your fathers. And, yeah, it wasn't because we were fewest. He, he you know, Yahweh Bashan Yahshua keeps his oaths, keeps his, you know, covenants that he makes with, you know, whatever covenant he made with our forefathers, he's going to keep that, you know, um. Because he keeps all, he keeps his word, you know. 
it says, I'm going to read verse 8 over, it says, this is uh, Deuteronomy 7 and 8, but because Yahweh love you, and because he has, he would keep the oath which he has sworn unto your fathers, have Yahweh brought you out with a mighty hand and redeemed you out of the house of bondmen from the hand of Pharaoh, king of Egypt. So, <clears throat> Yahweh Bashim Yashai chose um, Israel to, you know, uh, above all people, because to, just to keep the oath with our forefather Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, you know. You know. And um, anyway, I'm gonna say all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bashem Yon Shai, Bashem Kadash, the one is to. Elder Apostle Ray Nilsson, in fact, he's here to teach all truth and sincerity in Shalom.